In Texas, and you know what that means. Time to load up on the sunscreen. May is Skin Cancer Awareness Month, and tonight Teresa Woodard has one woman's story about how a mole on her back turned into skin cancer somewhere unexpected. When you talk to people, do you show this to them? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> My kids are so embarrassed all the time. <laughs> Julie Frampton jokes that this is a shark bite, but it's a wound from a war she's still fighting. So every 90 days, it's like throwing a grenade out there and you don't know if it's gonna land or not. Julie has had 24 cancerous spots removed from her skin. Two of those were melanoma, the most aggressive form of skin cancer. The first diagnosis came at age 34. And, and actually, I have to thank my daughter for that. Her daughter found the mole that caused this scar. Since then, Julie has seen a board certified dermatologist every 90 days, and she looks over every inch of her body every month. Melanoma reappeared at age 36 in a place that gets no sun exposure. I did my monthly exam, and I found a spot on my lady bits her genitals. It, it was jet black. It was tiny. It looked like the tip of a pen had you put it on a piece of paper. And I was very fortunate that I caught it. She's now a warrior warning people about the dangers of sun exposure and teaching anyone who will listen what to look for. A for asymmetrical, B for border, C for color, D for diameter. So if it's bigger than the size of a pencil eraser, you need to get that checked. And E for evolution, whether or not it's changing. Is it getting bigger? Is it getting smaller? Julie is a survivor because of early detection, but melanoma usually comes back. I feel like I was given a second chance at life and I need to do something with that. So Julie doesn't take a day for granted. In Ovilla, I'm Teresa Woodard. And here's something to consider. You need to apply sunscreen at least 20 minutes before you go out in the sun to allow it to fully get into your skin. And one layer is not enough. You need to reapply every two hours. Yeah, I